All right, well, it might not happen today. We're going to talk about an event that's going to help local first responders. And the best part about this event is it doesn't cost anything at all. And it's not today. This is on the, uh, in a couple of weeks, actually in one week. Uh, Family Fun Day in Old Lyme. Joining me this morning, Max Sabrin. Nice to see you, my friend. Nice Same to talk here, to you, too. You got an event going on. What is it, and, and how is it going to help the first responders? Well, it's it just to, to come down and thank and honor our first responders, uh, police, fire, and EMS with all the um, negative stuff going on in the country with, with police. This is like for the community to come out and, and appreciate what they do 24-7 because um, they're just, you know, being part of it. It's, it's a great family uh, the, uh, and this one is it's a family event. When we were talking a couple of seconds ago, you were saying that a lot of the people that are in this area, and this is happening old, in Old Lyme, they're volunteers. Correct. These it, guys aren't getting paid. No. These guys and gals, I should say, are not getting paid. Correct. EMS is, uh, is volunteer and the fire department and the police is, is a paid unit. But it, it, you know, 24/7, they're there for you. So this is a, a, a day of fun to come down with the kids, hot dogs, hamburgers. We're gonna have a dunk tank to uh, dunk a hot firefighter. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That's for the girls. There you go. <laughs> and it, it, it's just a fun family uh, event. Everything is, is gonna be complimentary. Thanks to Walmart of uh, Old Saybrook uh, Stop and Shop, uh, Marley's uh, uh, have has been stepped up for for soup. Uh, not not that it's a weekend for soup, but next weekend might be. Um, out of Cove, and it's just it's just a fun, fun, free event. Yeah. So, so tell me a little bit more about some of the cool stuff that kids can do. Well, there'll be there'll be a moon bounce, uh, face painting, balloons, uh, a dunk tank, which they all love, of course, yeah, hot yeah. dogs, hamburgers, and ice cream. So, a very, very fun day for for kids. It, it's great. It's you know, from we say from four year olds, but it's probably from two year olds on to, to ninety year olds. Everyone, everyone loves to see a fire truck and. Uh, not to be in the back of a police car. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Well, they can go in there and they can check it out too. For sure. And you guys are going to have raffles and stuff like that. So, yeah. so what does it mean to you to be able to see the people come out? It, it, it just shows that they're behind us 24/7 because you know we don't. When a 911 call comes in, we don't care about anything except there to save your life and help you. So. Uh, we just got to show appreciation for our fellow brothers and sisters that, you know, uh, the community cares about us. Good. Uh, tell us about the event. Tell us exactly when it's going to be. It's going to be 12 o'clock um, on Saturday, August 20th, a week from today. Uh, 1 o'clock we'll have the national anthem, and this ha hasn't been released yet, but 3 o'clock we're going to have a live performance by Braden Sunshine, a local TV uh, star who was on The, the Voice, who nice. was in one of the top 10. He's performing. We'll have live music all day. And it, it's just a good event, wholesome, family free, and um, of course, it's you know donations will be uh, gladly accepted for the first responders. And tell us where it is. It's at the uh, Shoreline Church on uh, 287 Shore Road, which is Route 156, right across from the police station. Very convenient. Oh yeah. So it's a it's a good area. It's it's, it's just a a great day, and and there'll be more information on your website, I'm sure. Of course, that's exactly what I was going to say. For more info, go to <laughs> WTNH.com. Pull down to the on air tab and. Check out the Good Morning Connecticut weekend section. Max, thanks so much again. This is uh, this is next weekend, August 20th. Let's have our fingers crossed that it doesn't end up being incredibly hot next weekend. Good to see you, my thanks friend. Thanks very much, Sam. All right, Noel, we'll send it back over to you. Oh.